We're here in Galveston preparing the ship for the fourth leg of this scientific voyage to explore the fate of and consequences of the oil spill that's happened in the Gulf of Mexico. This leg is going to involve something quite different. We are deploying probes up to two kilometers below the ocean's surface to uh, explore the extent of the oil plume that was emitted from the deep water site and also the extent of its impact on marine biota. Four scientists from Texas A&M will be joining us. Together this team of biogeochemists and benthic ecologists will be investigating the fate and impact of the oil on both deep water and the sediment ecology of the Gulf. Their investigations will build upon and complement the now growing database of information about the impacts of this spill on the Gulf of Mexico. We're in the final stages of mounting the two winches which we'll use to deploy scientific probes up to two kilometres below the ocean surface. The two winches will be mounted on the, uh, on the deck here, pointed up at the A-frame, and from there we will deploy them down into the water and over two hours they'll slowly descend to about two kilometers profiling various chemical parameters in the water as they go also collecting water samples which will come back up onto the ship and then we will do immediate analysis to look at sort of the oxygen levels within the water and try and determine whether we're in an area that has had significant amounts of oil pass through right now in the Gulf of Mexico the effects of the oil spill are still detectable. The consumption of oil components by organisms has caused a reduction in the levels of oxygen in the water, which is still detectable by probes. So we are now heading out with a team of scientists to help quantify the effects that are still present within the Gulf waters. This work is crucial because it will build upon and complement that of scientists from a large number of other institutes that are currently also out working in the Gulf. Greenpeace now continues its three-month tour hosting independent scientists that are investigating the state of the Gulf of Mexico.